Hi, and welcome back to the Big Jolo YouTube channel. Make sure you hit that like button. If you like my content, hit the subscribe button so you can get notified when you upload a video. Let's get right into this. So right here, I have a GT Racing gaming chair. And the reason why I upgraded is because the chair that I did have, I got from a thrift store. And the hydraulic thing for that chair is expensive and that chair was always trying to fall apart so I, I went to this one because two things or two three things i like about it. i like about it where you can let the seat lay all the way back and you know like you can even fall asleep on it if you really wanted to and the second part so that's the one part i like about the second part i like about this chair is if I go to here, reach under, so it's got the footrest. I wanted to get one with the footrest because I know if you're ever watching a movie or, you know, going to a friend's house or something like that and you take your chair with you, you have something to put your feet up. So how this thing works is it slides out and you just pull it up and then there is your foot footrest. Um... You gotta kind of sometimes figure it out on your own because the little book that you give to it gives you the pictures and how to put it all together, but sometimes it does um it's kind of hard to understand. So then you hop on to YouTube, and there's some YouTube videos that will help you set this kind of chair up, but then there's some other ones where it's edited and it's like what's next? I don't understand. And then that's the time you would have to figure it out on your own, so. So let me just put that, so like how it folds is, you know how you fold it this way? Now it folds this way, so then you can slide the footrest, like so. And uh, that's the second feature I like. Now the other two features I like about this gaming chair is these pillows. And yes, if I really wanted to, I can get the ones that massage to that brand. It's like an accessory. But for me, I don't need that stuff. So, um, one thing that I like about this is, um, you know, the bottom is for like your lower back. And the top one is for like your neck or your head. And it's super comfortable. So, if I had to pick a gaming chair, this one I would pick a lot because it's really comfortable. I was hoping though with the little arms, it would be kind of like connected somehow. We, the seat can all go all the way to the back. Or just like, I wish the armrest is a little bit bigger kind of thing. Like maybe a little more bigger than it is, but I ain't complaining about that. And then you got these wheels and the red... I kind of like red, green, and blue. The reason why I didn't get blue is I wasn't going to go for that theme. The reason why I didn't get green is like if you ever have a green screen or your green chair and then green screen are going to come together. <laughs> and like, you know, if you ever did like a green screen effect for gaming, so I went with a red chair. And I was like, yeah, you know, it's nice. So I've had this chair for about, I think I set it up for about a week, week and a half. And I'll give it my own view of 10 stars. But yeah, nothing too much about it. And then those other stars for the neck or head pillow. And then the pillow for your lower back. And another reason, another tip too I like about this chair is the sides here. So this chair kind of looks like what you would see in a sports car, right? Yeah. I like how it keeps you in one place, and uh, I can't wait to uh, use this chair. Maybe if I do a like, Twitch live streaming, I haven't done that for a while because I'm still trying to, you know, make my Twitch account. But when I do Twitch live streaming, and I might have a green screen, I might not have a green screen. I can't wait to have that in the camera so you can see my gaming chair too. But um, I'm not gonna put that out here on this channel just yet like i mean i probably done in the past but 
I'm still trying to like work out the stuff. But anyways, um I like this chair a lot. It's comfortable and then to move the back seat, the seat right here, um, all the way back and all the way forward like how it is. Um I'm not gonna do that because I don't have enough big enough area to show you. Well, I mean I do, but for the camera to pick up. So this will make right here where I'm pointing to. This will make your chair go all the way back or all the way forward. And then the thing under it, which would be the right down here, would make it for to raise it up and raise it down. But I just wanted to get my take on the uh, gaming chair, GT racing chair. So thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more content when I do upload a video. And I'll see you in the next video.